July 20th, 1969, 11.45 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. In a few seconds, more than 700 million television viewers would listen in on a conversation right out of some science fiction fantasy until today. All right, go ahead, Mr. President. Hello, Neil and Buzz. I'm talking to you by telephone from the Oval Room at the White House. And this certainly has to be the most historic telephone call ever made. I just can't tell you how proud we all are of what you For every American, this has to be the proudest day of our lives. And for people all over the world, I am sure they too join with the Americans in recognizing what an immense feat this is. Because of what you have done, the heavens have become a part of man's world. The conversation links President Richard Nixon from the White House in Washington, D.C., with astronauts Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin, who, for the last hour, have been out for a walk on the moon. It culminated a fabulous scientific, human, and media adventure, because television cameras filmed every step of the exploit, broadcast live from outer space. Beginning in the late 1950s, American and Soviet hubris confronted one another in a frantic, egotistical race into space. This footage, seen on TV by almost 700 million people at 9.50 p.m. on the east coast of the United States, were the first live images from the surface of the moon. Okay, Neil, we can see you coming down the ladder now. But wait a minute. How is it possible that a television camera is already filming Neil Armstrong before he even puts his foot on the moon? Okay, 